Why are some of my apps grayed out on Android? Have you ever noticed that some of your apps on your Android device are grayed out and you can't use them? This can be really frustrating, especially if you need to use those apps right away. Let's figure out why this might be happening. One common reason is that your device's digital well-being or focus mode might be active. These features can restrict non-essential apps to help you stay focused or manage your screen time. If focus mode is on, you might see some apps grayed out until you turn it off or adjust the settings. Another possibility is that the app is not compatible with your Android version. If you've installed an app from an unofficial source, it might not work properly with your device's operating system. Android may gray out these apps to protect your device from potential security risks. If you're using a work profile or Samsung secure folder, apps within these profiles can also appear grayed out. This happens if the profile is inactive or if there are restrictions in place. For example, if the secure folder isn't unlocked, the apps inside it will be grayed out. Battery optimization is another culprit. Android's battery saving features can limit background activities to conserve power. If an app is using too many resources in the background, it might be grayed out to prevent it from draining your battery. Sometimes the issue is with permissions. If an app's requested permissions don't match what Android expects, the app might be grayed out until the permissions are corrected. This can happen with sideloaded apps that request permissions that Android doesn't recognize. Device admin settings can also affect app accessibility. If an app is registered as a device admin, changes in security settings or updates can temporarily gray out the app until its admin rights are reassessed. Conflicting permissions between apps can also cause issues. If two apps require exclusive access to the same feature, like accessibility tools, one of the apps might be grayed out to avoid conflicts. Google Play Protect is always on the lookout for suspicious apps. If it flags an app as potentially harmful, it will gray it out until further investigation is done. Network or data restrictions by management tools can also limit app functionality. If an app needs constant network access but is blocked by these tools, it will appear grayed out. Scoped storage limitations introduced in Android 10 can restrict how apps access shared directories. If an app isn't optimized for scope storage, it might be grayed out due to restricted file access. A corrupted system UI cache can cause display issues, making app icons appear grayed out. Clearing the cache or restarting your device usually fixes this problem. Finally, if your device's date and time settings are incorrect, some apps that rely on accurate timing may appear grayed out until you correct the settings. So if you see grayed out apps on your Android device, it's likely due to one of these reasons. By checking and adjusting these settings, you should be able to get your apps up and running again.